my name is Willie Minix. I'm here with TakeLessons.com and I have my assistants Edda and Gideon and they're helping me make instruments out of stuff we found around the house today. So last video we made these cool little xylophone bell type chimes with water. Then we made a rainmaker and then we made a couple shakers. Okay Giddy, thank you. But this time we're using spoons to hit our little bell thing. But I wanted to show you a quick little instrument that you can make anytime around the house. You can make like spoon castanets. And what you have to do is you hold the spoons back to back like this. And you put your finger in the spot in between and your other hand, the rest of your hand goes around the spoons like this. And so then when you hit it, ah, I'm losing my grip. You probably can take it. If you had like, you try it. It work. Well, yeah, you can do it that way too. That's another way to do it. So Gideon just found another way that you can do this. But this one that way, and the other one that way, and this one overlapping. The other spoon. And then put your finger in between them, right? Instead and then you of whack that, it. That. Cool. I think that works and will you tape them? Yeah, I'm Maybe you could tape them but put like a rolled up piece of something in there. Another kind of clapper that you can make that's pretty easy. Can I see that tape for a minute, Etta? Mm. Uh, if you can find a couple old sticks, actually, yeah, I'll use this tape. If you can find a couple little toothpicks or popsicle sticks or something like that around the house, I have a couple craft sticks here. And if you can get a couple bottle caps, you can take a little piece of tape and you tear it off. Yep, and you just wad it up on the end and put one of your bottle caps on there. And on the other one, you do the same thing. What are you doing? I have no idea. Okay, well don't do that right now. And you put a piece of tape on the other end with another bottle cap. And then the bottle caps can make a little clacker too. It's not quite as loud as the, um, as the spoons, but it still works pretty good. Yeah, that works. Oops, fell off. I don't think the spoon tape method worked. Okay, so we learned that. Huh? <laughs> or you could go like this. You could tape it this way. That's Careful. Close. Here you try. It almost fell off the tape. Anyway, I'm Willie Minix for Take Lessons. These are my assistants. You have a great day, and we will see you in the next video. Hey.